morning, Grant Middle School. Today is Tuesday, April 4th, 2023. It is a 2.30 dismissal. I'm your host, Lydia Ressler, and this is my co-host, Carter Markham. Today is an odd day. We will have taps during the fifth hour. Be sure to have a book with you. What's on the menu today? We, are, we don't have it yet, but we're sure it is delicious. The lunch ladies will also be selling goodies for 50 cents, but have your money ready. You may not get up to buy anything after you've sat down. Remember, no food outside at lunch. No cell phones at lunch. Turn them off and put cell phones in your locker. Not in your pocket, not in your binder, in your locker. And also, no earbuds unless they are being used for class. Students, you need a green or the laminated nurse pass in order to see the nurse. You cannot just go on your own. AP teachers, please look around your room and check the dress code. If a student needs correction, please send them to 125. What announcements do we have today? Tonight's and Friday's track practice will be at Springfield High School. Thursday will be at GMS. It may go until 5, so keep listening to the announcements. Learning Lab is tonight after school. Stay for help if you need. It's a huge help. There will be no Learning Lab Thursday this week. All 6th grade students that turned in a Camp Silco form listen up. The parent meeting will be April 5th from 6 to 7 o'clock in the all-purpose room. Students are not allowed at this meeting, but please make sure you have a parent there. Get excited. Scholastic Bowl has practice tonight after school. Also, the music festival is tonight at UIS Sangamon Auditorium at 7 o'clock. This week will be a beta fundraiser honoring our unsung heroes in the building. Each day we will have a different theme. To participate, you need to bring $2 each day. Here are the following themes. Today, Teacher Day, just like your favorite teacher or staff member. Wednesday, Security Guard, just like your favorite security guard. Thursday, Unsung Hero, dress like your personal hero. Money raised will go to our security guard's favorite local charity, such as the Boys and Girls Club and Primed for Life. Hi, my name is Lisa Masoba, and I'm interviewing Mr. Crawford. I'm Mr. Jesse Crawford, that is, and I'm um, security here at Grant Middle School, and it's going on about, mm, about three years of me being here, about a year of being um, security, and I'm loving every minute of it. What is your favorite memory with the student? There's so many, but if I could pick out just maybe a couple, one would be Darion Nash, him uh, appreciating my support, um, the encouraging words that I give him. Um, sometimes some, you know, some, some big brother love, and um, another one would be Tavian Rice giving me hugs because I give him popcorn sometimes. But um, I've had so many memories um, with the kids here. It's it's hard to just pick you know one or two, but I got a lot. Um, what do you about, what do you like about working at Grant? Other than the paycheck, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I love what I do, and being a security guard. Well, I started off at front desk, in house guy, doing security. Each uh, position has its uh, job criteria, and I literally moved up, and I got to know the kids um, a lot better. Um, you know, sometimes it's a, it's a hassle, but I love what I do, and it's fun here. And, you know, I would trade it for nothing. Um, That's how I get on my nerves. Mm -hmm. What is the lesson a student has taught? What's what? What's the lesson a student has taught? Gosh, patience. Now, no particular student has taught me that. All of y'all have. You know, we can't just go in, uh, gloves off, swinging, kicking, all that kind of stuff. You gotta be patient, understanding, you know, showing that love that y'all need. Y'all need to show us some love sometimes, too. Yeah. Also, remember to be respectful of others' property to and from school. The expectations at Grant is to keep your hands and feet to yourself at all times during the school day and on your way to and home from school. Also, for your safety, students should only cross at the designated crosswalk areas, Chatham Road, Sands with Mr. Williams, and Amos. Now please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, 
and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now please observe a moment of silence. Why did the man name his dogs Rolex and Timex? Why? Because they were watchdogs. Our idiom today is wrap your head around something. It means to understand something that may take a bit of time and effort. That's really complicated. It's going to take a moment to wrap my head around that. Our vocabulary word today is chortle, spelled C-H-O-R-T-L-E. A chortle is a joyful party muffled laugh. My two-year-old sister chortled as she played Knock Down the Blocks. It made me laugh, too. Do we have any birthdays? Yes. Parker Dodd in eighth grade. Happy birthday! Today is Talk About It Tuesday. As you know, we are celebrating the unsung heroes, the security guards this, the security guards this week. We know that many of the security guards work as mentors. Who is one of your mentors and what have you learned from them? Happy Tuesday!